Hi, I'm seven-time U.S. National Water Ski Champion Wade Cox with HO Skis, and we're here to teach you how to water ski. Before you ski, make sure you get a properly sized Coast Guard approved vest. Make sure your rope is AWSA approved, in good condition with no frays. Helpful accessories will include a tip attachment bar to keep the skis together and some weights to keep the rears and skis down in the water, making it easier to surface. For the best progression in teaching someone the water ski, we start with some dry land instruction. We use a seated chair position, arms straight, then we progress to seated on the skis where we'll actually have someone towing the rope our designated helper is going to pull the skier. The skier simply resist enough, keep the knees bent, arms straight. This is going to allow them to come up on top of the water. For little kids, we go a step further and towing them around the yard, then progressing to a sandy beach with that helper pulling them through the water. After conquering that, we move to the boom, then on to behind the boat. Before getting started, it's always a great idea to review the basic hand signals of water skiing. Speed up, slow down, speed okay. Turn the boat around, take me back to the dock, stop the boat. And last but not least, I'm okay after taking a fall. The most useful tool in teaching someone to water ski is the boom. With ski tips attached, slightly out of the water, we take our seated position and arms straight. And we allow the boat to do the work for us. As the boat driver starts slowly, the skier keeps tips up, chest up, eyes up. The next progression is to put the skier on the five foot handle section on the boom. Again, the skier tips up, chest up, eyes up. Once we've mastered the boom, the final progression behind the boat. A useful tip is to connect the tow rope as high as possible from the boat. This helps pull the skier up and out of the water much more quickly. With ski tips still connected, the skier is going to simply resist enough to stay in their seated position with arms straight, allowing the boat to pull them on top of the water. A great driving tip is to keep the line tight, allowing the skier to balance. The driver will accelerate slowly until the skier is on top of the water and then continue to accelerate to a comfortable speed. Once on top of the water, for balance, the skier is going to keep the knees bent, arms straight, shoulders back. Once the skier is up and comfortable, we're ready to remove the tip attachment bar. Once we remove the tip attachment bar, the skier is going to have to focus more closely on tips together, knees together. Once we feel comfortable and we're ready to cut, we're simply going to shift our weight in the direction we're going to go while maintaining knees bent, arms straight, shoulders back. If you want to go to the left, shift your weight to the left. Want to go to the right, we shift weight to the right. This controls the direction of the skis. After we've mastered two skis, we're ready for the slalom. All HO combos are equipped with a rear tow loop on one of the skis. This allows the skier to go from two skis to one, and we do this initially by dropping a ski. When dropping a ski, the skier simply shifts their weight to the slalom ski, lifts the heel, stepping out of the drop ski, placing the foot in the rear toe loop on the slalom ski. Now we're ready for deep water slalom starts. We suggest using a deep V handle when learning how to deep water slalom start. This keeps the tip straight coming out of the water. Just like on two skis, we're gonna have our seated position, arms straight, tip up, chest up, eyes up. 
As the driver slowly accelerates, the skier simply resists enough to keep the seated position with arms straight. Once the skier is up on one ski, same as on two, knees bent, arms straight, shoulders back. This instructional should give you all the skills needed to become a water skier. We hope you enjoyed this instructional. So grab your friends and family, teach them how to ski, and be sure to head on over to hosports.com for all your gear needs and see you on the water soon.